Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what does thread.sleep method does in Selenium WebDriver automation code? Let me answer. First of all, thread.sleep is not recommended to use in Selenium automation. Okay, that's the first point. And it can be considered as a last option if none of the Selenium web driver inbuilt weighting mechanisms like implicit weight, explicit weight things are not working, then we may go for thread.sleep as a last option, but directly it is not recommended to use in Selenium automation. What is the problem then? Okay, so what will happen if you use it? Okay, and what will be the problem? The problem is all about fixed wait time. Let's say I'll take a few examples to show you diagrammatically. For example, this is a, let's say zero second. This time is zero second, okay, at this point. And uh, let's say this one is uh, 10 seconds. Okay, here I'm giving 10 seconds, 10 seconds. And let me draw a line. So between 10, uh, zero to 10 seconds, any time in between the element may come. Okay, and element may not come exactly at zero seconds. Sometimes at one second, it will come two sec after two seconds with a delay. It may appear on the page three seconds, four seconds, five seconds, or maximum 10 seconds sometimes like that, let's assume. So now, since the element is not coming with a fixed time, sometimes it may come early, sometimes it may come late, something like that, okay? What I have done is I have used, uh, if I have used thread dot sleep, okay? Thread dot sleep, uh, this sleep is a static method. And thread is a predefined class in Java. And here we have to provide milliseconds to use. If I give like uh, 10,000 milliseconds, okay? It is nothing but equal to 10 seconds, okay? If I give the wait time for thread.sleep as 10 seconds in Selenium automation. Now, let's assume that when you are performing the operation, at three third second, at third second, the element came. The element appeared on the page at third second. Now thread.sleep is saying 10 seconds, but the element already have come. So will thread.sleep, you know, uh, perform the operation at the after uh, three seconds or it has to wait for the entire 10 seconds. It has to wait for the entire 10 seconds. So this time is wasted. This extra seven seconds is wasted because it's not a smart wait. It's a fixed wait. If you say 10 seconds, it will wait for 10 seconds. For example, if I take an example of uh, you meeting a friend and you your friend said that let's meet uh, at the particular coffee shop at the 4 30 and uh, what happened was you are very punctual your friend is also kind of punctual kind of men mentality so to not uh, you know miss the time so what you have done is you have started early and you reached the coffee shop by four o'clock itself your friend also in the same manner he also uh, he or she also thought the same thing and uh, at four o'clock only your friend also arrived now you both arrived way before 4.30. But you thought of meeting at 4.30, you are there at 4 o'clock. Do you stare yourself uh, even though your friend is visible without talking and without meeting, just waiting for 4.30? That's not a good idea, right? Teledot sleep will do that, okay? Even though your friend came, you are not going to, uh, you, you are there before your friend, but you are not going to do anything. So what will happen if this uh, particular time is wasted? You see, when the element comes in three seconds and extra seven seconds are being wasted, okay? The Selenium script will wait because of this thread dot sleep because of its 10 seconds, but the element came in three seconds. Since it is not a smart wait, it will wait for the entire 10 seconds and this extra seven seconds will be wasted because of which the performance, okay? Performance of the automation scripts will go down and the execution of the scripts will be slowed down, okay? Performance will go down because the scripts will execute very slow, okay? Here and there, if you are using thread dot sleep, because of that fixed weight, if the elements are coming before time also, then nothing is happening because of which it will take more time to run the scripts and the performance or execution time will increase, okay? Performance will reduce, degrade, and execution time will increase, okay? And not only that, sometimes what happens is you have fixed the time as 10 seconds, but the element came at 15 seconds, okay? We don't know. That may happen in rare cases, but maximum to maximum thread dot sleep, you gave us 10 seconds. So what is the problem here? If the element is coming behind this 10 seconds, the script will fail. Selenium will not be able to find the element. But in case of, but in case of 
selenium inbuilt weights like inbuilt weight and uh, implicit weight and explicit explicit weighting mechanisms under explicit weighting mechanism we have normal or general explicit weighting mechanism and fluent uh, explicit weighting mechanism any of these weighting mechanisms which are inbuilt in selenium are smart by default that means even though you mention here in this case what i will do is even though i mention i mean uh, like 50 seconds or 100 seconds otherwise 100 seconds as a wait time but the element comes in 3 seconds remaining 97 seconds will not be wasted at uh, 3 seconds only the operation will be done okay selenium will identify that the element has come within 3 seconds only i don't have to waste the remaining 97 seconds the script will continue without wasting the extra 97 seconds or sometimes if the element is taking more time here 100 seconds that is too much right uh, 15 seconds also will be taken here okay like that so this kind of flexibility will get in the inbuilt mechanisms in selenium but it come into thread dot sleep it's a fixed weight and uh, because of it which it has a lot of problems okay like uh, slowdown of the execution scripts and brittleness in the scripts because sometimes the element may come late than the fixed time and the scripts may fail uh so hence selenium web driver waiting mechanisms are inbuilt waiting mechanisms are recommended and thread dot sleep should be only used as a last option last and final option when inbuilt mechanisms of selenium web driver are not helpful for you then only you will finally go for thread dot sleep okay very rare cases you may have to go okay so hope guys you got the answer for this question thank you bye bye